she's cooking today. Um, today I'm going to do a El Pollo Loco chicken bowl. So I already started my guacamole right here. Some lime, lemons, tomatoes, cilantro. We got red onions, green onions, a couple of seasonings. I do have taco seasoning, but I'm not going to use it. So I'm going to show you a quick way on how to do it another way where it takes more, way more authentic. And I'm going to just get straight into it today. Okay. We're going to add some oil. Crank up the heat. And um, drop the chicken in there, you guys. And this is just chicken breasts. I had three chicken breasts, and I just chopped them up. They were skinless. I chopped them up in the blocks that you see right here. Open it all the way. Especially the blinds, because she'll knock them down. Okay, you guys. Turn up the fire a little bit. Y'all know chicken cook quick. So we're going to get right on into it, okay? We're going to use a little bit of cumin. Remember I told you about that cumin? Get a, whole, get a, a big old thing of this if you cook tacos and food like that a lot. Because this is, like I said before, the main ingredient to taco seasoning. So you just put a little cumin all through there as much as you want. Get you some cilantro leaves, not parsley, cilantro leaves. Okay? You can use real cilantro if you want. It does not matter. And a little bit of lemon pepper, okay? Try to use lemon pepper with this recipe because you want that authentic taste, all right? And of course, to give it that authentic taste, use the Goya. I've been stuck on Goya and I've been using it. And um, it's less salty. It's a little bit much, much more healthier. It's more flavored than any salt. So that's why I like it. And the seasoning is amazing. We're going to add some green onions. I mean red ones. Okay. And we're going to add paprika for color. And this is a quick meal. Okay. It's a real quick meal, feeds a lot of people. It gets you full, that's for sure. I was gonna make enchiladas with beans and rice, but I said what I'm gonna do is place my bowl with beans and rice, add this chicken and stuff on top and make me a chicken bowl. And put some tortillas on the side. I love cooking with this wok. This wok, I love it. It grabs the food. You see that color, you guys? Look at that. Look at that color. It's beautiful. And the smell is like mommy.com. Okay, we're going to add a couple of green onions in there. I love green onions, you guys. I love onions, period. I love garlic. I love food. My big chunk yourself. Chunk, chunk. Okay. And I'm going to add a little, about a teaspoon of butter. Just to give it a little, a little taste. Okay, look at that. You can take that Goya and marinate your meat in that and throw it on the grill. I think that's what them Spanish people be doing. More thing you guys let's get this onion powder in here I almost forgot so far so good you can grill your meat and um, take it off the grill with the same seasoning throw it on the grill and chop it up um, if you're you know able to do that that's even better because you'll have that smoky effect smells so bomb you guys like no lie look at it you see it 
Oh my God, it looks delicious. It smells bomb. Okay, we're gonna have some pinto beans and rice. And layer it in the bowl. Okay, we're gonna add a little cilantro. So I can get that full effect. And some lemon juice. A little bit more. And that smells just about what I'm looking for. You can add shrimp to this, you guys. Some cooked shrimp. Add some cooked shrimp with it. You can get a bag of cooked shrimp. A nice, large size of shrimps for like five bucks at Walmart. Throw that in there. And you can feed a lot of people. You can feed at least eight people with this because that rice and beans gonna fill them up. It's not they like they gonna be just eating on all meat. Okay you guys. We're going to add our yellow rice. Okay, you guys, I'm already adding my yellow rice. Okay. And we're going to add the beans. Okay. We're going to add the chicken, okay? I'm not feeding eight people. It's only me and moms today, so we're going to eat all of this that we eat. Go we greet you, okay? And then you line it all up. You just put you a little thing of that. Cilantro on the side, some tomatoes on the side, some lemon, some of that guacamole. Look at that guacamole. Look at that. A little corner of that. Okay, and a little pile of cheese. Okay, you guys? And that's it. This is my chicken bowl. Okay, made by yours truly. With that all being said, thank you guys again for watching me, watching my show. I love you guys. Keep supporting me. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I had to make my video short. My baby been tripping all day long. Anyways, thank you guys. Goodbye. Mwah.